Hey everyone, so this is a sixth generation iPad Touch. I believe there's one or two generations after this one. Uh, this one is rocking a variation of the A8 chip. Uh, so it is pretty old. Uh, but I just want to talk about using this here in the end of 2022. Uh, mine still works pretty well for the most part. Uh, one issue I do have with it is the battery. I don't know if it's the battery itself or if it's just the the iPad thinking the battery is dying, but the battery seems to die really, really fast. Uh, that's one issue I have with this. Um, but other than that, it's actually a pretty decent, tiny little device to use in 2022 here. And I think this would be a great alternative to a phone for young kids. Uh, so you can still do messages on here, which is cool, uh, as long as you're over Wi-Fi, of course. Uh, so it looks like a nice little device still, I think. Mine's in blue, as you can see. It still has a very nice look to it. It is metal of some sort. Uh, I still have your camera with actually flash on there. You have the iPod logo there. You have your volume rocker. You actually have a headphone jack. You have the lightning adapter. You have one speaker. Nothing on that side. Then you have the power button there. And you actually have the front facing camera there as well. Uh, so like the app store still works on here. I actually just downloaded Roblox on it yesterday. So you can still get different apps. I just want to say offer up here. It is not the quickest of things, that is for sure. But you can still download stuff all you want. Go ahead and hit download. It just takes a moment longer to download. And of course, I forgot the uh, home button right there, which I have absolutely love. Uh, while that is downloading, as you can see, it's downloading right there. Uh, let's go on to the internet here. Again, this is not going to be the quickest of devices anymore, but it still works. The being as it is a very small screen, it of course has a very small keyboard there as well. Again, we're just connected to my home Wi-Fi, of course. I'll let this thing load in. But like I said, it works very well. For being how old it is and how small it is. It actually isn't too, too bad. And there's probably slower to new devices out there than this one is. Get out of that. Then you can see offer up downloaded here. Uh, which means you of course still have support for the app store, which is really cool. You know, this is quite old. But you guys can see here, like my battery is all weird. It was basically full when we began this uh, about three minutes ago. And it is almost yeah, as I'm telling you it's 20%. Which I don't know if it's actually down to that or if it's just the uh, indicator thinks it is down to that. Uh, let's go ahead, we'll go into Roblox here, and I plugged it in just in case, uh, we don't want it to die. So that's really like the worst thing, is just the battery, and again, I don't know if it's actually the battery itself, or if it is just the indicator thinking that it's dying. Uh, we're going to Royal High here, you cannot play this in max graphics, I tried doing that yesterday, uh, it does not work. So I'm just going to turn it down all the way. And this is Royal High, which is a bit of more of a graphical game in Roblox here. And we'll let this load in. One thing we'll notice is it will get a bit hot on the top half of it. Uh, like it's getting a little bit warm on the back already. Let that load in. Again, this is a very, very tiny screen. I mean, this is smaller than the iPhone SE is, uh, and that has a small screen. This thing would be sweet if they put in the newest processor in it uh, and turned this into a phone. It'd be pretty crazy. Uh, but you can see, Royal High does not work, uh, even in those graphics. All right, and I just tried another game called Fly Race. It just kicks you right back out of it. So Roblox does, is not really working too well on this device. Uh, so that is a little bit sad. 
Um, but again, you can do internet browsing. You do have emails on here. You, of course, do have music on here as well, uh, which again, you can use. Uh, so this is like iTunes and Apple Music or whatever. Uh, you can use the headphone jack or you can hook up through Bluetooth as well. So those have Bluetooth. Uh, so those are very nice. Of course, YouTube itself works still. All right, then we'll just show you guys a little bit of how the speakers sound here. Some royalty-free music on YouTube. Again, it only has the one speaker right where my thumb is. Uh, but again, you can use the headphone jack or through Bluetooth if you needed to or wanted to. Uh, that will, of course, be better. Again, this is volume up all the way. It's actually not the worst speaker ever. Uh, it actually does sound doesn't sound too bad. Uh, just it's only one, and it's only on one side, of course, because it's only one. Uh, but it's not the worst thing, especially for watching YouTube or something. Uh, and you see, I put it up to 1080p, and it works just fine. Uh, so this is excellent for that. And of course, you can also read books on here if you want to. Uh, it is super light, which means you could sit here and read books all day. So like I have Kelvin and Hobbes on here. And it's on probably turn on me here. Uh, which is nice about this is you can of course zoom in and out. And then you can scroll through things. And you do get color on there as well for your comics. Uh, again, it is very, very small, so you will have to zoom in. Uh, but then it works just fine. So really I think one of these would be great for you, especially for a kid that does not need a phone yet. Uh, so you can still, again, you can still do messages through it, uh, or you can download other apps to do that. Uh, just have to have Wi-Fi. Again, Roblox on this one, 6 Gen is not working too well, but I believe there was a Gen or two after this one that has better processors in them, uh, if you can find them, that is. Uh, but for basic usage, I think it is actually a pretty cool little device. Again, I wish they'd bring back this, th th this small of a device in a phone, uh, as this is even smarter than the SEs. On uh, this light of a device, this thing weighs like nothing. So it's very nice in your pocket. You forget it's even there. Uh, yeah, y'all let me know what you think. Uh, as always, I appreciate you watching. Hope you have a good one. I'll see you next time. Goodbye.